Photography in terms of visual arts is perhaps one of the most democratic art forms so it has a unique ability to engage people and we're very interested here in gallery photography in looking at how that can um, work in a political way so I think that um, there are a number of issues like a lot of the issues that, that Aftermath raises which people are familiar with and maybe a little jaded about and kind of don't engage with as readily as maybe people who live along the border or in Northern Ireland. So we were very, very keen to cite this exhibition here in one of the leading cultural venues in Dublin. We're delighted that Dr Luke Gibbons from NUI Minute is going to launch the exhibition because again, someone of Luke's stature will bring a whole other audience and, and attention to this project, which, which it merits. And, and I think post-conflict, it's really important that these issues continue to be addressed and that's why we were interested in showing this work here in Dublin. What you're seeing on the, on the walls around are people who are um, living today, obviously, in County Louth, maybe someone in South Armagh, elsewhere, they're real people and they have a story to tell and um, in terms of putting the exhibition together, I think the what is uh, been really significant about this is you're not looking at uh, sort of snapshots here, these are photojournalism, I mean they're, they're photographs that were captured with people after a long process of engaging with them. Uh, it's been a two-year project and the exhibition is a, the final outcome of that there. When we see photographs like these, we feel impelled to look at the stories behind the pictures. But I think it was Walter Benjamin once said that such are the pressures of the past that sometimes history can only be told through images. And one of the most moving aspects of the exhibition here is in the pieces to camera at certain points. Um, people are telling their story and they seem to be adjusting to what has happened and then suddenly some flash of memory comes up from the past and the story stops and the camera just leaves their face and indeed you could argue that the photographs are picking up from that spot that the photographs are picking up where narrative leaves off so in that sense the photographs are about what's unspoken but cannot be said and that is the gap between what happened and the representation of what happened. And that gap can often take decades, not just years, to unfold. And it had an impact on the North, and, and we all accept that. But I actually think that the Northern Ireland conflict had a, a profound impact on us in the South. And for me, what happened, and it, it affects us still to this day, is that we never grew up. 